Hello and welcome to this video where we are going to be creating a betting site app like uh, Bet365. Um, we are going to do a full stack application um, in, in different parts. So hopefully you guys will follow along and make the website uh, just like I do it. So first of all I have created a folder calling, called betting site. Inside of this, we're just going to be creating our application. Uh, we're going to be using Next. So we can just search for this. And here it says MPX create Next app latest. What is your project name? Let's just call it Betting Site. Are you, would you like to use TypeScript with this project? No. Yes. So right now it's creating our project. <clears throat> Perfect. Um, something else that we're going to be using in this project is uh, CSS Tailwind. But first we're going to see into our betting site application that we just created. Um, I actually have it right here. So the first thing that we're going to do is say npm install tailwind css post css auto prefixer we're going to let it install and then now we want to create our tailwind config file so we say npx tailwind css init and then p so you can see here now we have this folder um, what we want to do is go into our global styles and delete everything. We want to say tailwind base, tailwind components, and tailwind utilities. Yeah, just like this and save this. Something else that we need to do is go into our tailwind config, into our content. And I'm just going to paste this in, but you guys can pause the video and and write it exactly like I do. This just means that all of our pages and components are going to be using um, uh, Tailwind. There's actually something else that I want to do. Let me just open a new window. Window. Uh, let me go to another project. We want to create a new file called jsonconfig jsconfig.json Inside of this we got we're just going to type this. Um, what this does is that when we are importing stuff we can just import from the base URL instead of actually going to um, to type something like like this all the time. So save this and I can close my folders here. I'm also going to close this. Just make this window fine, good. So now we actually have our application. What we can try here is just to start it. npm run dev. And it says here static server on localhost 3000. So we go to localhost 3000. And here's our next application that we just created. Um, what I'm going to do is just really click, just delete everything inside of this um, index. Um, also this. And then just really quick test if um, the Tailwind CSS is working. We can just say something like be black and then say, hey. Yeah, as you can see here, our background is black, so our Tailwind CSS is working fine. 
perfect so now the project is ready and we can get started designing our bedding site <coughs> 